So I'm elaborating on the Tim Cook situation, the CEO from Apple. People are going to the blog site at www.sukileemusic.wordpress.com and they're like, what is happening with this situation? These people have me so broke where I'm on $100 a month on general assistance. I just reported this to the Secret Service because Nicki Minaj is using my information, my social security, everything, saying I'm classified as some Illuminati celebrity and I haven't signed any paperwork and I am not a part of the Illuminati whatsoever. So she has been stealing over $100 million using some record deal money that was supposed to go to me to pay all these people to lie for her and say that she's me and she not. So I was going to the Apple store at Westgate Valley Fair Mall in San Jose, California. Um, and they have an Apple store there, a computer store. And I was going there to type this blog so I can forward it to the FBI about this woman threatening to murder and kill people if they say who the real Suki Lee Siobhan Butler is, which is me. I have not given permission and will never have permission for anybody to impersonate me. So my time at the Apple store, I was there about three weeks. I met a sales associate there who I thought was a sales associate. And he told me his name was John. Now I'm thinking his name could have been James. I don't know. But then I found out that it's the CEO from Apple and he's working there under disguise like as an Illuminati interest. And um, I just wanted a romantic you know, relationship with this man. I really fell in love with him there at that store. And Justin Bieber um, basically took over that store. After he found out that I was there typing this blog, him and Nicki Minaj took over the whole store. They start saying um, this is a government interest and they start bringing all these celebrities, Chris Brown, and all of these people have contracts that they cannot talk to me, speak to me, or really give me any type of record deal. So it was just something to be have for Nicki Minaj to be evil. So when they found out I was interested in Tim Cook, the CEO, Justin Bieber went and put him in some sort of Illuminati contract. I don't know if he read it or not, but this contract obviously is t saying that he cannot speak to me, talk to me, have sex with me, or marry me, but that he can lie to the government and say that he's with me. And so... Now he wants to be with the real me. Well, he always wanted to be with the real me, but I don't think he realized what he signed. And now these people are brutally raping him, beating him up, telling him that he has to have oral sex with Kiki Palmer, Lauren Kiana Palmer, this nasty woman who's going to be a homeless woman who stole all my music, trying to use it and say she's me, is sitting here trying to say she's Suki Lee and telling him, well, you have to have oral sex with me. And what I don't understand is why Tim Cook doesn't have enough common sense to leave these people alone. I'm upset that he can walk away from this. You can take that contract to the San Jose Secret Service Office and they will tell you that it is void, that it is a fake government contract. Nicki Minaj is fucking Barack Obama and has been forcing Jay-Z to sign these contracts as Barack Obama and they're fake. These people are seriously sitting here letting people anally rape them and slap them and beat them and they don't have to take this. I don't care how much money she gave you. You need to tell her to take you to court or take you to a funeral home. I mean, that's the only choice. I'm not going to sit in a car and let these people beat me, rape me, and put their dick in my mouth where I'm throwing up in front of who my future wife's window. That doesn't even make sense. I am upset that people just act like they don't know what to do in this situation. What you need to do is take that contract to the Secret Service. I don't have a contract with these people. Or I would have been posted it online. I would have scanned it and everything. This woman is just trying to scare people to make people think she's the government. She's an evil African lying to the government. And they need to kick Nicki Minaj, Beyonce, knows all these people that she is with this mask and bodysuit out of the country and bring her back to Africa. I'm telling Tim Cook he needs to get a restraining order against all of these people. Quincy Jones Brown, Justin Bieber, Jared Leto, 
um, Nicki Minaj, Lauren Kiana Palmer, Kiki Palmer, Aquanetta Brielle, all of these names that these people are using, Onika Mirage, they got all these alias names that they function under. People just need to go get a restraining order. When you get a restraining order, I don't care if she has an Illuminati contract. They cannot rape you or do anything because you have a restraining order, which will block her contract. So that's what people need to do. And so at this time, she's trying to lie to people saying there's some Illuminati Suki Lee wedding or wedding proposal, and that's not happening. I told Tim Cook he needs to come to my house and marry the real me, and that's it. We're going to go elope, and that's it. And if there ain't no elopement, this is not happening. And when I do elope, it's going to be on my blog site. People are going to see Suki Lee, the real Suki Lee. The real Siobhan Butler that sings and going to perform paparazzi is really with Tim Cook, the CEO from Apple. You're going to see pictures. You're going to see videotape. So if you guys are out here in the Bay Area or anywhere thinking there's some wedding and you look at that blog and it hasn't changed to put my picture up with his, it is not true. Nicki Minaj must have hired somebody or got some fake impersonator and she's going to go to prison because they have no permission to use my information or try to hire any type of um, impersonator.